Welcome back, everyone. Before I start the forecast, I'm going to breeze through these great viewer photos. I have a few to show, so I'm just going to try to get through these quickly so I can get to your information. So we had this nice, pretty rainbow over Rolling Fork yesterday. Thank you, Tony Michelle, for that picture. We had a nice picture of a rainbow over Silver City, so another great photo. This is of a waxing crescent moon last night over Wayside. So thank you, Robert, for that picture. And thank you for these beautiful sunrise photos that you sent in. Here's the first one, the second one, and the third one. So again, thank you, Robert, for those great shots and Tawny and Ryan for the rainbow pics. Now, getting to your headline. So as I just mentioned before the break, it's still mostly cloudy now, but some clouds will clear out a little bit later, just like what we've had for the last couple of days. Rain chances are still minimal and the heat index will be near 105. So 76 in Greenville and Greenwood, 75 in Clarksdale, and also in Tunica and Oxford. Winds are blowing from the south at 6 miles per hour for Greenville and from the south at 5 for Greenwood. So our highs for today pretty much going to be in the low 90s range. Now Clarksdale could remain in the upper 80s, 89 for them and also for McGee, Arkansas. But just expecting to remain in the low 90s. And winds will be from the south around 10 miles per hour, then becoming easterly this afternoon. The overnight low will be near 74. We'll have mostly cloudy skies. Could still have some rain this evening, but we should be drier overnight. And then for Friday, same conditions once again. Highs in the low 90s. We have that chance for afternoon showers and thunderstorms, although some could start to occur during the late morning hours. And winds will be from the south around 10 miles per hour. So looking at future trackers, still dry this morning. But then by the afternoon, at least the early afternoon, we could start to have some rain moving in and continuing on and off during the evening. And we should be dry overnight. Then for Friday, just same pattern, expecting the rain to develop maybe late morning, early afternoon and continuing on and off into the evening hours. Now, Saturday should be mostly dry day. And then we have a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms for Sunday, a 30% chance for Monday and a 40% chance for Tuesday and Wednesday. Thanks for tuning in and have a great Thursday.